our DVDs one and three age appropriate training focus in on those learn to train and train to train stages of athletes. And again, athletes who have developed those physical literacy skills then can move into further training, which is what our, uh, our other two DVDs focus in on. And it's really about what's appropriate at this stage of development now for those athletes. So it's physical preparation, cross sport, not sport specific. So DVD one really talks about a good dynamic warm up. How do we do a warm up that's appropriate for nine to 12 year olds? And what does that look like then for 14 to 16 year olds? How does that change? Uh, we also work on core training and agility in the first one. So those are specific things that learn to train and train to train athletes need to work on and then what's appropriate for each of those ages because it changes as the athlete develops and goes through their uh, growth spurt. It's really important to realize that as the athlete develops physically, what we call windows of trainability change. So as they go from 9, 10, and 11, uh, things, their body changes, which means their physical ability changes. When they hit that growth spurt, they become a little more uh, awkward because their bodies, have, their arms and legs have changed in length. So things that we need to work on change. Uh, we need to recognize when athletes are going through that, but also because then their physical body changes. So when we get into that 14, 15, 16, as they go through their puberty, we can actually do more work with them. So we need to watch as they grow to ensure that we're hitting the right windows of opportunity. Not that the windows close, but that we are already trying to get them in optimum time. Within a, within a practice, um, again, we need to ensure that we're taking care of sports-specific skill, but also both physical preparation for the athlete. So if the windows of trainability that are present, that we find time to do speed for them in that, the appropriate speed for that athlete, and we need to work it into their overall athletic development. When we talk about strength, we need to know that we need to find time in our practice to do age-appropriate strength which you'll find on our third DVD when we talk about speed and strength development, but what's appropriate to them. We can't just spend our time with our athletes doing uh, tactical skills, uh, teaching them how to do the trap uh, for hockey, but we need to find a way to engage them in their physical prep so that we can prepare them for their next coach, so that we can prepare them for active for life or going into a high performance stream. And keying in on those physical things in our practices, as well as the technical tactical, we had to find time for both in our workshops. The Age Appropriate Training DVDs really um, go together nicely from one to three, uh, with two being games of the purpose we talked about. And it's um, workshops that we can come out to from Sport Manitoba, we can come out to your, your uh, sport club, to your community to deliver, or you can purchase them online, you can get them through the Coaching Manitoba office. And it's really just about educating our coaches and on understanding how we take long-term athlete development uh, from the paper and put it into play at our practices so that we're actually getting quality athletic development across the province. And I think that's really key for us and it's understanding the theory but now here's the practical, here's how we put this stuff into play.